This is a stark story. So on the one hand, uh, shares slid as much as 21% today. Here's the why. It's Swiss asset manager suspended Tim Haywood. He's the manager. Did I just skip? Did I skip one? No, I'm good. Okay. Uh, uh, basically, the, the flagship absolute return bond fund he managed, and then they boot they booted him. They suspended him because of some issues uh, into a probe with his record keeping, and then warned of risks to his investment to his investment flows. Unbelievable hammering of the stock. Well, okay, so there are a couple of things here. It is not good when a top portfolio manager gets ejected for risk management procedures, problems with that, and record keeping. You don't want problems with record keeping but or risk management. But not concerns about his honesty. But, but not concerns about his honesty because that ameliorates it somehow. <laughs> um, he was just sloppy. I, I think that also, though, you can't uh, sort of negate, you can't sort of neglect to talk about the fact that the GAM multi bond absolute return bond fund, which he had managed, trailed nine. 96% of its peers over the past five years. So the performance says a lot, right? I mean, how do you get money in if you have issues with the person at top and if you've had this dramatic underperformance for so long? And this comes at a time when, ostensibly, there is going to be a shift in monetary policy, so you don't necessarily have such a clear-cut path. With bond funds, if you want active management, they haven't proven it. Yeah, uh, the fundamentals do matter, and you actually have to make money for people, and uh, they seem to be struggling in doing that, you know. And who knows, maybe that's why they started taking a close look at the record keeping. Well, fair point, <laughs> because know? they also said, hey, it's it's not just him that's going to prevent the flows. It's also market conditions are going to be a little bit risky, risk appetite we're not sure about. But this also goes to the heart of an issue that we've seen in an ongoing level, which is consolidation within the asset management yes. space. And if you cannot mm -hmm. prove yourself at this point, uh, investors are punitive. They're saying, look, we're not going to wait around any longer. We're not going to pay you the money uh, for fees because, frankly, we can get an index fund. So, you know, that punitive quality, I think, is probably a little bit more knee-jerk now than it was 10 years ago when people are more educated and have more low-fee options.